Hey guys, uh, in this video we're just going to quickly cover how to set up Google Webmaster Tools for your Agent Fire website. So the first thing you want to do is just head over to Google. Um, you want to go to google.com slash webmaster slash tools. The easy way to do this is just to go to Google, type in Google Webmaster Tools, do a search. It's going to be the first thing that pops up and you're going to click on uh, that first link. Uh, for me it says Google Search Console. So this will bring us to Webmaster Tools. Now in the top right, it's going to show either the Google account that you're logged in on or it's going to show uh, a login button. So I'm just going to go ahead and switch to the correct uh, Google account that I want to use here. Um, in today's example, we're going to be adding uh, ranchanddesert.com is the domain name we're going to be setting up Google Webmaster Tools for. So in the uh, enter, so you're going to hit... Uh, let me go back a second. You're going to click uh, add a property, which is this big red button over here. Uh, once you've done that, it says enter the URL. You're going to enter the URL without the www, without the HTTP. So just enter the, the, the actual domain name without any of that stuff. So here we're going to enter uh, ranchanddesert.com. I'm going to click continue. Now we're going to need to verify this. So to verify, you're going to see it'll show by default the recommended method tab. Ignore that. We're actually going to click the alternate method tab. Uh, here you should have four different options. This may change over time. Um, just go ahead and click the HTML tag option. This is going to give you something that you have to paste into your website. So you're going to copy this entire thing. Let's go ahead and open up a notepad. All we want from this code is a little, uh, is a little snippet uh, in between where it says content. So all we want is this. However, I can't seem to select just that. So we're just going to copy this, open it up into, uh, or we'll paste it into a notepad. And let's just copy everything between the quotation marks that come after uh, content. So we're going to copy that. I'll just cut it. Um, now you're going to log into your Agent Fire website. You're going to, so this is uh, the dashboard when you get in. Over here on the left, you're going to look for the SEO item. And from SEO, you're going to go into general. Once you're in the general area, you'll see a tab here for Webmaster Tools. You want to go ahead and click that. Now, where it says Google Search Console, you're going to enter that code that you just found. So, again, I copied it. Uh, I'm pasting it into where it says Google Search Console. We're going to click Save Changes. Now this will be updated on the site. Now let's go back to Search Console. Now all we'll need to do here is hit Verify. Sometimes this does take a little while to propagate. So let's go ahead and click Verify, see what happens. Okay, and that actually worked. Um, if it does not verify, then all you need to do is just give it a little bit of time and come back to that, that page. Um, but in this case, we've got it verified, so let's just go ahead and click Continue. Uh, and now we're all set. Webmaster Tools is set up. It really was that easy. Now go ahead and just watch the next video in which we'll describe how to set up your XML sitemap within this uh, Webmaster Tools console.